we should, in fact, be back at block. Ian Tunnel. See, the thing is, we know Ian is Nathan's brother because yeah. he got so focused on Pokemon, he forgot to eat. Yeah, 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 yeah that, that happened. So he's next to me eating chicken tortilla soup? Mm hmm. Yeah, good job. All right, so yeah, yeah we should yeah. be back at clock. Yeah, I'm over here eating soup. So. Yes. So, Not only is it back at clock, it's also soup time. Yeah, soup o'clock. Yeah. Also, this is a certified soup stream. Yeah. No, I'm I'm eating the food. Yes. I've got uh, soup. We here at Cobra Strike Lightning Bolt are adamantly pro soup. Yeah. No. Uh, good soup. I'm a professional soup. <laughs> Okay, uh, so we're gonna do wayward. With, with an adamant nature, I have boosted attack and reduced special attack. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you buying clothes at the soup store? Uh, so I'm gonna go in with Joy and with Black. So I can actually see what I'm doing in here. Uh, and I'm gonna do something incredibly unusual for me. I'm not gonna fight the wild Pokemon here. Now I gotta remember how to get to the little girl. He's not going to fight the wild Pokemon because he doesn't want them to to explode. Uh, that in the interest of time. Eventually we will get to the point where we will fight wild Pokemon, but I want to pair up with the girl first. I just got to remember how to get to it. If that's how this game works. Um, I'm not saying it didn't happen, Sammy, but I don't remember it happening. Oh shit, my chat window. That's in that's incredible, Sammy. I think she's up here. I don't know, man. I'm just eating soup. Uh, did you eat pumpkin soup in college? Why would you? Yeah. That's like cannibalism. It's a bat. Now I gotta be kind of careful here. I'm not gonna go too fast. So I am gonna pick up this item. Hey, I found an escape rope. Well, you are what you eat, but no. You are what you eat, or you eat what you are. Dun, dun, dun. Oops. Okay, I'm gonna fight this one Pokemon. That was just him, like, instinctively Pokemon fighting? No, I, I menued wrong. Hold on. Let me try it again. You are what you eat, or you eat what you are. Bum, bum, bum. I, I expected you to do the bois there. I did. Did you not hear my bomb? I did not hear the bois. No. Nope. You didn't. You. We got no bombs. Yep. No inception. Wah. Well, hold on. Rusty, you're leaving us incredibly vulnerable. The dog could come in here and do something, and we wouldn't even know what the dog doing. I'm working on it. Working on it. It was there. It was distant, but it was there. Oops, this ain't the way. Where's that little girl? Maybe go back up? It's possible I have gone the wrong direction. Was that, that better? Was... Yes. What the dog doing? Yeah. That's much better. There it is. Now we can ponder what the dog is doing. What is the dog doing? <laughs> Knowing the dog sleeping on one of our beds. Almost certainly. That's... That okay, let's try this a final time. You are what you eat, or you eat what you are. There we go. Now we can stream. 
people, we've got people paying for this content now. Yeah. We can't, <laughs> can't let them down. We can't let the people down. <laughs> it was a little quiet. You're a little quiet. Uh, I'll be a little right back. I got, I got done eating soup. Knows is that a clever combination of both Pokemon and Star Wars? Starmon is a terrible Digimon. Man, this scores um, being real fucky tonight. Got it. Uh, Star you Wars. Isn't it saying it's Pokedex entry that is believed to be from space? It, like, communicates with space by, like, rhythmically pulsing at it. Oh, I've rhythmically pulsed at space before. I, I have no... I will take no further questions. There she is. I can afford to kill the Zubat. Specifically the Zubat. You should catch it and become friends with it. Rusty, that would even break the rules. The rules? Oh, uh, you've already caught something in this zone. Yes. I'm Thank Mira. You. Hey, so what are you doing? I'm pairing up with Mira. Where are you? Wayward Cave. Or uh, oh. whatever this cave is called. Whoa, 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 whoa. I have not done the Wayward Cave stuff. Okay. I'm Mira. I was catching Pokemon and then I got lost. I'm so scared. Please, please take me to the exit. You decided to escort Mira. Yeah. I'll keep your Pokemon healthy all the time. I like helpful Pokemon moves like Growl and Minimize. Those kinds of moves are my favorite. Found a nugget. Nugget? Those kind of items are my favorite. Let's double check. Make sure I'm not missing nothing. They do give you more Mooney. Oh, sorry. This isn't uh, Kingdom Hearts. They give you more money. This cave is so easy to get confused. Do you know where we are? Yeah, <laughs> fucking no. I have, like, a vague angling. Make sure I'm not missing nothing. No says carry on my wayward cave. I, I forget exactly what this cave's called. I think it's wayward cave, but I may be getting that wrong. Maybe right. that confusing with another cave. I don't know. You can check back. I could check. You're probably not going to, but you could. That's a sturdy geo. Not anymore! Yeah, we were kind of Wombo Combo that Geo did. Wombo Combo? Yeah. He's got the happy feet. That ain't Falco. That ain't Falco. Where are you at? Whenever you're in this cave, that's a question you ask yourself <laughs> a lot. Did you know that, uh... So do you know where the Wombo Combo came from? Like, the like name? A, a, a attorney? Um... But I'm assuming it was a reference to Spongebob. I no. always assumed it was a reference to Spongebob. No. So, the Wombo Combo, for the the famous uh, Smash Bros. clip, um, it's named after that because it's the name of a pizza yeah. at a certain... Because um, that was... It was poor Zoo who got... Uh, who got Wombo Comboed. Yeah. Um, and I think they were tri-state at the at that time. I think so. Yeah. Um, and so Where's like. My map? It's, right, it's there. right there. Oh, time map. Just to it being a key item. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, Wayward Cave. Yeah. Um, and so it's like the the name of like a specific like pizza Ria's you know pizza or something. Yeah. And so it, you know it was the wombo combo. <laughs> Uh, you're right, Adam. I love these kind of double battle segments that they did in Diamond and Pearl, um, because all of the experience comes to you. Uh, that said, I should have done this battle as a singles instead of a doubles, because double battles first. Yeah, he's worried about that blowing up. No, I don't think it's... Quit matter. Um, but, uh, especially in a game where, uh, we don't have all of the quality of life features that you get starting in, like, Gen 6, uh, these, these double segments are really great for grinding up a weak Pokemon, and I have spent literal weeks in, uh, those segments. Hey, Nose, love you, love you buddy, but, uh, don't talk about my, my boy homemade waffles like that. He was the one uh, commenting that set, and um, he was just ranked as one of the top 100 melee players of all time. Uh, I think Mango was number one. I mean, I don't know if I'd give him number one of all time, but there's like three people, one of three people I would give. Yeah, there are, there are a couple of contenders, maybe. It goes Mango, Armada, Ken. I don't know if I put the Ken ones all the time. I would. I think for a while he was. I think there's an argument for a hundred bucks. Hungry Box is such a good username. It's very good. Probably go. I could probably go pull that out. I didn't have a single Pokemon. I, I'm showing you a freaking Manaphy, and you're like, oh man, I don't want that. It's so rare he doesn't know what it is, he doesn't know what he's looking at. It's like, oh, look at this weird diseased mantine you've got. Gross. Well, if he was like actual connoisseur, he would be like, oh, I don't know what that is. What the hell? That's awesome. So they went Mango 1, Armada 2, Hbox 3, Ken 4, Mewtwo King 5, Leffen 6. It's probably Mewtwo got over Leffen. Uh, PPMD 7, Azen 8. That's a name you haven't heard in a long time. Uh, Zane 9, Pluck 10. I agree. With you. I, I may rearrange the order there a little bit. Yeah, that's about how. about what I think, though. Just outside the 10, uh, top 10, they had Chewed at 11, Axe 12, PC. Oh, Axe? PC Chris 13. Did someone say Chew Dad? Chew, Chew Dad. C H U D A T. Yeah. Not C H E W D A D. Yeah. Aw. Uh, Chew is uh, the best ice climber player of all time. 
not the most influential. The most influential is Wobbles, because he literally has Wobbling named after him. The main mechanic that they use. Uh, Wizard of 14, Isaiah 15. I feel like, like, I want to rank PC Chris and Isaiah higher, but, like, I don't think I can. I can't say I followed Melee enough to have a strong opinion one way or the other. Well, like, those, those two are the ones that, like, battled Ken back in the day. Uh, but S, Fat 16, uh, KDJ, Korean DJ, 17, S2J, 18, Hacks, 19, and Shroom, 12. Better have burn heal. For the most part, I agree with all of that. And a potion. Chew, Dan. Thank you, Rusty. Thank you for that. This little girl's like, why is he? Why is he talking to all these rocks? I want items. Rusty, you're really like typing really hard over there. Yeah. Everything alright? What up, it's your boy Chewed out here with another 360 no scope video. 360 no scoping is a thing you can totally do in Smash Bros. You have gun in Smash Bros? special is gun. gun. And you can do the 360 with it. Yeah. I didn't really bust that out in our set. And it doesn't have a scope. Ergo, you can 360 no scope in Smash Brothers. That's true. I mean, not in Melee. You can 360 super scope. I don't know, 360 no scoping might be back in uh, uh, Halo's real popular again. Yeah. Guys, also, Halo is real fun again. It's about to be too many games, though. About to be. I'm Camper Diego. I am yeah, we've got, there. We've got this. We've got Destiny update coming soon. We got Halo campaign on basically the same day as Destiny. Yeah. Um, Forza is already getting to where I'm running out of time to keep up with the content. Um, and it's not even a lot of it. Um, Yeah, I still haven't actually played uh, the, the uh, uh, multiplayer of uh, Halo yet. It's good. And I really want to. I just have, haven't really had the time. Hey, I'm going to totally put everybody on the spot here, live on stream. Uh, Sammy, Ian, do you want to do the campaign and multiplayer? Once, uh, I understand that the campaign won't be multiplayer at launch, but once multiplayer comes out, you guys want to do the Halo um, co-op on stream? That could be fun. Can we do, like, can we do it without, you know, I know couch co-op's not really a thing anymore, but I don't know how that works. Right. From what I understand, um, multiplayer is a feature that's going to be added after launch at some point, probably like February or March. And it'll be just like doing campaign in any other modern shooter online. I'd be down, sure. But I guess they're doing a thing that I kind of like, where they're drip feeding the pieces of it that are done and not releasing the parts that aren't. Interesting. Which kind of makes sense, right? Like the multiplayer is yeah. done, 
and they even put it out for free to like one build hype like that was absolutely a business decision and it's making them billions of dollars even though like they're not making money off of it yet they're they're already cashing in on that just from like hype um but uh um they're not really they already delayed it a while which is a good call if your game's not done especially if it's a halo yeah well it's it's it looks like you got a response there yeah i'm seeing that and it's not, you know, Bungie anymore. It's, it is 343, so they are taking a little different approach. Mm -hmm. So I think 343 did the last one, too. Uh, yeah, 343 did uh, Guardians, which was a weird Halo game. Um, but then with this one, at least for the multiplayer, they are definitely stepping back into more uh, traditional Halo stuff. So I'm interested to see where this goes. Yeah, I think they're learning. Um, Guardians was not popular. Is Guardians the one with Nathan Fillion in it, or is that ODST? Yes. Uh, it's both. ODST is where Nathan Fillion was introduced in the series, I believe. Okay. Uh, he was, he was an ODST, in ODST, and then he becomes a Spartan later. I guess. Okay. Because they get they get better Spartans that can be just dudes now. Just guys being dudes. Yeah, yeah I mean, uh, when it started, uh, like the Spartan ones had to be abducted and flash cloned and then left their uh, dying sick clone with their family secretly while uh, these uh, kids get abducted by the government and uh, medically experimented on to give them like three hearts and 11 spleens and uh, more muscles than anybody knows what to do with just so they can wear the armor. Flash um, Clone is the horrifying sequel to Flash Dance. Um, but now you can just put on the, the armors better so you don't need to do all that uh, awful stuff. But that's part of the reason why uh, uh, the Master Chief is like 7 8 whatever how tall he is. Yeah. yeah that's not like his armor adding a foot and a half to his height he's just like a mutant so when, no. when in halo lord did he battle thomas the tank engine to save uh, steve from minecraft nathan yeah part suck That, that wasn't that was canon, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm used to all of my video games crossing over now. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Did I spoil you? I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> they they created this armor and were like, oh, this is killing people. So instead of downgrading <laughs> the armor... <laughs> they just upgraded the people. <laughs> and horrifying... By, by kidnapping them and replacing them with sick clones that would die in a couple years so their families wouldn't get suspicious. Also, they brainwash them so they'll just follow orders. Except Master Chief. He's better than the rest. Yeah. Actually, his whole... Um, it's, it's kind of interesting. Uh, I don't really want to get into a big Halo lore dump. Not too uh, late there, for that. There is a, there is a book about um, him growing up and like him, him being seven. Um, and emerging as a natural leader and all the people in his class like looked up to him um as while it they, were it, no as it were um yeah they were all uh sussy doctors um so uh they are somewhat brainwashed but will also just do whatever the hell john says to them 
Oh, that's the plot of uh, Guardians. John from Garfield? Yes. No, John 117 is the Master Chief's name. And, and when did he adopt Garfield? Uh, after the fall of Reach. <laughs> Some time. Um, is it, uh, which, which campaign is it that, like, Cortana's, like, the antagonist or whatever? Uh, this one. And oh. Guardians. Oh, okay. Uh, I better have uh, Smackdown heal. At the end of Guardians, she goes kind of rogue. Now I'm getting into spoilers that I'm not sure if Sammy's gotten into, so I'm we're okay. going to stop that. Okay. It's up he and Garfield in Halo 2. Was there a Spartan named Garfield? God, I hope so. There's so, one named Kel. Ah, now I need Smackdown heal. So, uh, four is the one, like, where he's, like, crash-landed on, uh, uh, the Prothean, Promethean, whatever. The Promare, the Prome the Adobe Premiere planet. You can play four on PC right now. If you've, if you bought the Master Chief Collection, that one, that one you can do. I, I don't have... Sammy, no! <laughs> Sammy just private messaged me the worst thing. Wait, wait, wait. Guys, we need to read this guy's text. Yeah, he lives there. I live here. I'm a man who lives in a cave. Ooh, yeah. Two of them. <laughs> uh, Rusty, you really get all that Halo out of your system? I went deep into Halo in high school. There are like 80 books, and I read most of them. Maybe Rusty was... Rusty? Rusty, did you read the book where it says that his suit takes care of all of his personal needs? All of them? It doesn't jack him off. Did you <laughs> even listen to the Brian David Gilbert report? It doesn't do it. Wasn't the source of that like a drill tweet? Probably. That makes sense. <laughs> it would be. <laughs> that, that absolutely tracks. <laughs> I am I'm no longer the... aware of where I'm at. The Gravemind is already a terrifying villain, and combining it with Garfield <laughs> hurts me. More like the Garfmind, am I right? That's literally what she messaged me. Is is the flood still a thing in in Halo, or are we are we over uh uh, uh this zog this? zombie virus taking over the universe. Are we past that? I mean, it's at least tangentially there because all of the Forerunner installations are about stopping the Flood. So even if they're not a direct problem, the stuff is still there. I'm, I'm asking, did we put that plot point to bed? I'm not sure if they're going to show up in Infinite. There's not enough... Uh, Mira, data. she used a move that did damage instead of a move that did that. <laughs> <laughs> I need you to help instead of whatever you're doing. <laughs> I'm not saying that that was a bad decision, uh, but it certainly wasn't a good one. Uh, uh, next time, if you could just make the correct choice, I, I sure would appreciate it. <laughs> In a binary world where there is only good and bad, there was it was not a good decision. <laughs> Leaving not many options left. <laughs> I 
I like that it's literally playing on the TV right there, but we're actually like, playing. <laughs> Do you want to see me in profile or not? I just think it's funny. Like, no, there's there's literally like a 50 inch TV that it's playing on right there, but we're you know just watching it off of the capture. the the capture the I don't know six seven inch capture. I mean, that's literally how I play Switch games anymore. I just think it's humorous. You got it. It's my beautiful face. I'm gonna do like this. Because uh, starting at level 30, Kazu will stop obeying me, so I wanna get ahead of that. Okay, I'm only a little bit lost? Can you just use an escape rope and, not and win? Not, not save, not, and not save the girl. No, I mean I could escape rope, but I wouldn't save the girl. Is that a issue? I, mean, I want to save the girl. She's lost and all alone. Would you have her die in the cave? Ian? Yeah, she would die. She was pretty far back there, yeah. Would she go? There's not. There are. Yeah, if you, other... if you uh, escape rope, she just goes back to where she spawned. Yeah. There are other people in this cave. Yeah. Like, and they all have a buddy. She would be all like alone. Like scary, scary, enormous hiker men. Yeah. Who live here. Okay. All she right. doesn't have a flash Pokemon, Ian. I've got the flash Pokemon. All right. How does she find the same room? Best to not ask those type of questions. You think they'll ever make a tally knocker Pokemon? A what? You know what I'm talking about. We played Scarlet Hollow. A what? Oh, you haven't played you haven't played episode two with me yet. Tally knockers are said. Tally knockers are ghosts that knock on the walls of mines before they collapse. Ah. Oh. And it's a great name. <laughs> and so my question was, do you think there'll ever be a tally knocker Pokemon? Um I wouldn't put anything past Game Freak at this point, my guy. You too, right? I think so. Oh my god. What? Snake. Sammy, you didn't make this, did you? No, you didn't make this. This is something you found. Okay, thank God. Good peek on the mic there. No problem. Rip headphone users. It's something. She sent me a Garf Mind art. And did it blow your Garf Mind? <laughs> You, you heard me say, oh my god. Smitty. 
SmackDown! I am a monument to your Mondays. <laughs> what I want to see is uh, when Garfield kicks Odie off the table, him uh, do a little crouch thing that uh, Halo players do when they uh, kill somebody. Teabag him. <laughs> That's the other disturbing art that Sam is making right now. <laughs> Garfield with energy sword just through. <laughs> Sammy made adorable art about that one teddy bear thing that's trying to murder everything. Oh yeah, the kids don't know what teabagging is anymore, so they're like, why are they twerking at me? <laughs> Smack that. Thank you. Yeah, that. I definitely knew the name of that, that creature. That entity. Good news, I found where she spawned. I'm only a little lost, it's fine. Maybe you going straight down there? Yeah, there's that. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's see. Okay. okay. Only a little lost. Okay. Let me go up here. Here. That's gonna take you back. Okay, go down here. Back to the past. Samurai Jack. He made it back for a little. Yeah, no, he made it back. Yeah. Spoilers for the final season of Samurai Jack. Also, go watch the final season of Samurai Jack. Like, not, like, right now, like, finish watching this, uh, this live stream and or VOD. But... Chat. And just go watch Samurai Jack. It's, it's dope as shit. Yes, because it's a foolish samurai warrior wielding a magic sword. <laughs> <laughs> foolish samurai warrior wielding a magic a giant coconut. An unspeakable evil. We'll take a shape shifting <laughs> master of time. <sighs> Wielding an unspeakable coconut. Wielding a sword. <laughs> Coconut. <laughs> Go watch that video too. Okay. Do I roll the dice and see if I can hit him with a ground move? Why not? 50-50. No, have you not seen I'm gonna link it. Yeah. yeah do it. Uh, hold on, I'm uh, I'm gonna find this and you need to know. Two for two! <laughs> Holy shit. You lost it. You lost that 50 50 real hard. I did. Now it's time for a little payback. It's time. I <laughs> could fucking die. Uh, Nose, I give you permission to stop watching this so you can watch Samurai Warrior. It's important to me. Unspeakable coconut. Yeah, you fought them. Hey, I found the exit. You did it. Oh, there's the exit. I want to get tougher so I won't be such a scaredy cat. Nate, bye bye, thank you. Bye. Bye, dude. And now. 
Oh. Pull him back out. Now I can. Or if you're a DBZ Bridge fan. Wait. It was a good. It was a good sound choice that they made there. Yeah. I'm just waiting for Nose to come back. Yeah. Let's see what his report is. Will he come back wielding an unspeakable evil? Maybe he'll be wielding a foolish samurai. A foolish samurai warrior. Wielding a foolish samurai warrior. Okay. The D pad does not help me out here. Nope. Yeah. Mike's real, real fucky in this game. But yeah. It's moving one tap of the D pad moves me two spaces. Yup. There we go. That's difficult to use. Double checking. Oh, I want to fight the child. Fight the child. Child. Okay, Sam is just sending me a billion horrible garfs. <laughs> Rock this upon yourself. So, <laughs> Rusty, you gotta have a good meal. Back out! <laughs> Was it not the greatest thing you've ever seen? Slash that star, John. Full dozing a monkey. That monkey is flat. There's sometimes, Adam, when I think the internet was a mistake, and I watch a video like that. <laughs> Then I know it was a mistake, but it was a funny one. No, and then a video like that steps forth to oppose it. Wielding a foolish samurai warrior. Okay, so uh, one thing I've kind of noticed with this game is that after you 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 press A to talk to somebody to get in a battle, uh, especially if you're at like a corner, like away from them. Diagonally. Mm -hmm. And then you press A to see what they say after the battle, and it doesn't do anything, so you have to get a little closer and then press A. So I'm close enough to talk to him before the battle, but not close enough to talk to him after. I don't know, man. I'm gonna step away for a second. Okay. I miss you. Honestly, if it's a YouTube video, if it's uh, going to be a foolish uh, warrior of Korodai wielding a magic dinner. Yeah, I wouldn't bolt it the back. I don't think that'll go well for you. For the rest of the episode, we're going to speak entirely in a uh, YouTube video. I'm going to fight this to you, dude, and I'm going to tell him, You must die! Bro, I don't... I don't remember enough YouTube boots. Yeah. Um, 
you're gonna have to go somewhere where you can learn about them. Uh, thankfully, uh, the princess has invited us to, uh, 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 sure was nice of the princess to invite us to, uh, the castle for a picnic, eh, Luigi? Boy, am I glad that he's, <laughs> he's up there, that we're in here, that he's the sheriff, and that we're in here. Then I just remembered yes. that he's the sheriff. See, I, I wasn't able to talk to him there. I had to get a little closer. Wahaha! You found me. Go ahead and laugh at me. I found a rare candy. That was some good, uh... Intuition there? Yeah. I'm gonna say good item sense. I remember. I have played these games a time or two. Dende's gone, remember? The balls are inert. The balls are inert. I went looking for that earlier and apparently they took that video down. YouTube looked at it and they were like, You must die! Or maybe they just wanted me to come back when I was a little richer. Kid. <laughs> Rusty, are you back? I hear him breathing. <laughs> he is breathing. Rusty, are you back? I am back. Did you bring back I some. Did... What? Did you bring back some bingus? No, I had to run and do something real quick. You maybe heard my breathing. I did hear you. We did, we did hear. We've decided that we're gonna uh, spend the rest of the episode talking in YouTube poops. Nathan decided that. Nobody what else. Is nose, what is Nose talking about? He's talking in YouTube poops. Okay. I understand now. Yes. Rossi, Rossi had to relearn an ancient language for this conversation. Well, now, the comment is, the balls in my other pants make a bit of difference. The balls are getting huge. And it... Like, we're a sponsored stream now, and... Yeah. No, not sponsored. We are not sponsored. sponsored. We are we're not sponsored, but we are, we are, uh, like, like, uh... Affiliated? Affiliated, yeah. So, like, we gotta be careful about what we're putting out there. Yeah. And if you do want to sponsor this hot mess... Yeah. Oh, my God, there Our, are four yeah. new messages from Sammy. How many Garfs? All of this base could belong to you. Oh, it's not just Garfs anymore. Go wiggle our wires. Let's go do some wire wiggling. Which is not a euphemism. I hear nothing. Yeah, Ian's wiggling wires. I am not wiggling wires. <laughs> now our cameras also. Yeah, camera's fine. Uh, when you wiggled wires, camera's acting a little. Yeah. Do we have switch audio? Uh, not yet. No, I can see you and game. Oh, game is paused. Yeah. Yeah, it's not Nathan. It's not caught up to game. Yeah. 
going to lose it. Yeah, it looks better. Well, game is moving. Yes. Uh, we don't have switch audio yet. Let's try that again. Properties. Hold on. I might have to do this again. There we go. Yes, we do. We've got sounds. Okay, good. It does sound nice, doesn't it? Uh, Ryan, should yes. you learn Aerial Ace? Uh, this is actually, you'll see, 60 base power. 60 base power. Uh, the question is, is 15 PP worth not checking accuracy? I'm going to say yes. Yeah, I would I would make this choice pretty much every time. Yeah. But they have the same base power. I thought they were both 65. Nope. That might have... You want them to be 60 base power so they get the uh, Technician boost. The only Pokemon that matters on is, like, Scyther. I was say. Uh, speaking of old internet stuff, uh, my favorite 4chan post is, uh, your favorite Pokemon is Scyther, what's yours? <laughs> All the people going, well, I guess it's Scyther. Scyther, I guess. I'm told it's Scyther. <laughs> it's very good. I do whenever, love whenever Four Chan is very silly. Uh, that's my favorite. I do I do love it when when you go to uh, uh, go to a comment section and it is exactly what you want it to be. That is. There's a lot of things that came out of Four Chan that aren't great. So the good ones. Yeah, you have to appreciate. Are them. good. Yeah. I mean, you can say, like, the, the fall of our democracy has come out of 4chan. Yeah. I remember as a little wee lad, um, and as I was just starting to explore the, uh, uh, explore the internet. Nathan was very insistent that I never go to the dark place. Poor Jen. Was I wrong? No, no, you were absolutely right. Um, uh, but, like, you told me, like, uh, uh, if, if I went to 4chan, uh, the computer, uh, could instantly be hacked or something. I was telling you whatever I would, no, I would do to uh, whatever I could say to not make you put a fortune. No, no, and that was that was absolutely a no. That was absolutely the right call. Yeah. I to this day have never actually been on fortune. You're not missing much. I'm well aware. I know what fortune looks like. I know what it is. I don't feel like I'm missing much. You're not. I will. I kind of feel the same way about Reddit sometimes, but uh, while I'm here, uh, y'all ever just drink a hippo? Uh, no, I typically for eat. legal reasons. I'm gonna say no. Nathan, they said you can't bring that up anymore. That's why I'm saying no. Nathan, you signed that NDA. I didn't say anything. Speaking of NDAs and illegal foods, apparently there's uh, fugu chips that you can buy now. Rusty, I don't understand a word you just said. No. They are potato chips made with fugu, which is that kind of uh, puffer fish that's extremely deadly. Like if you don't cut it just right, you just die. I do remember that being a plot on a bunch of Saturday morning cartoons, yes? That's a real thing. Yeah. It's illegal to purchase Fugu in the U.S. Um, just as a quick note, I've already got my Mount Coronet ca uh, capture, so I don't get a capture in here. Yeah, we've, 
We've already been in here technically. Yes. Yeah, uh, so you for go example, through. If the first thing I were to encounter was say, oh, I don't know, an evil team leader, um, I wouldn't be able to catch it. This, that's an Unfortunately, the first thing you encountered was not an evil team leader. It was a meta type. Yep. I don't know. The actual first thing I encountered was like a Jutsu bat or something. I like gather you do that again. It is in the past. Yeah, I have like yeah, I have like three Geo dudes in my in my run, and I'm using my dupes boss too. My dupes clause is like, dupes are fine unless I decide I don't like this dupe, and then I will catch something else. How often do you nuzlocke? Very rarely. Um, but I do um, uh, wonder walks a lot. Uh, Ian, how you do it is like, you get three tries, and then on the third one, you either have to go with it, or... Yeah, I, I get effectively, you know... Yeah, yeah. The, th the third one I either have to go with it or you forfeit your catch. Or I forfeit my catch, yeah. So. I want a proper fish license. Hasn't SpongeBob been trying for 20 years to get that? Yeah. Listen, it wasn't a good joke, but it was the joke that I could spin off of. Yeah. Listen, I'm not proud of it, but... It's out, the here. it's out of the world, and I can't take it back now. It's an idiot joke, but it's your idiot joke. Thank you, Sammy. Someone appreciates true humor around here. Hey! Baby mode! <laughs> it's the no-nos. According to one theory, Mount Coronet is where the Sinnoh region began. In a newly created world, a world where only time flowed and space expanded, there should have been no strife. But what became of that world? Because the human spirit is weak and incomplete, strife has spread. This world is being ruined by it. I find the state of things to be deplorable. Hi, my name's Nate. I'm on a Nice to meet you. I'm on a look at everything. Could go over here. The good box. Get my watch Badoof. I wanna go up here and see if that happens. Something like this. Something like here. Yep. Good call. I found an ether. A nether what? And a nether what? And I, and you guys said I had a dumb joke. How's my teamwork? Uh, fight this hiker with not my electricity. Yeah. Well. Ha ha ha, you're just a kid. How are you supposed to be a big man like me? Man of pink. And I am. I'm using my, my busted legendary. I don't know, just enough stats. No, I'm sure this is the Geodude I'm gonna list, let lose to. I don't like these hikers talking about what a big man they are compared to you, a child. I mean, can you blame them? There's a lot of man there. I don't like men. Yes, you do. Which sucks, because I do. <laughs> Sometimes boys are pretty, and I hate it. I don't actually hate it. Yeah. It is what it is. Oh, you're sure impressive. I guess it makes no difference if you're young or old in Pokemon battles. You see he the... saw me, and it became nighttime. <laughs> it's jarring. <laughs> the, the shift there. 
Oh, I like this roll. <laughs> for the rest of what, Sammy? <laughs> I was waiting for the rest of what? You took a long time to say I do. <laughs> you were like, I don't like men. And I waited for the punchline for a while. And then I said, yes, you do. And then you paused a little bit longer before you said, yes, you do. I don't feel like it was that long. It was a hot minute, Ian. Hot like those men you like. <laughs> Sometimes boys are really pretty. Shut up. Thank you, John. Somebody in this chat gets it. <laughs> Wait for it. God. Thank you, Sammy. Nathan, now I need SmackDown. Yeah. Maybe it's SmackDown. Yeah. <laughs> yes, with the... No, it's okay. I've got a, a, a super cool watch that I can put. Look at my fancy super cool watch. I like how you looked at your absolutely empty wrist in real life. I mean, I have a cool watch. Yeah. I mean, if you have a cool watch in real life, you just never wear it. It's because of my wrists. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a $200 watch. I don't actually know how much it was. I found a puck ball. I didn't have enough of those. Oh, it's Onyx. Yeah, he's got lots of defense, decent amount of speed, and that's about it. I'm gonna actually use more tissue. So I do get to catch you. Duck! <laughs> oh, I'm not on camera. You didn't see me duck. I just did that for no reason. <laughs> Good job, Rusty. Way to commit to the bit, still. Did, did you at least hear me grunt from my commitment? I did. Yes. Good. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> Balls are technically boosted. They are, um, but I think I can catch them from the wall. I think you can too. Nice. I got a Poseidon. Sit up. Alright. It never remembers using its odd power, so it always tilts its head in puzzlement. Would you like to give Psyduck a nickname? Yes. And in honor of our YouTube poops, I'm gonna name it. Pengus. Very good quote. God, we have 13 quotes already. And Sammy's only been putting them in for like a week. Don't say a word, just take it. I obtained an odd keystone. No, uh, it's fine, Sammy. Yeah, and her Rizal, uh, Kobe, and oh, that's interesting, Nathan. Yeah, you got the odd keystone, and the spirit tomb is right at the beginning of the route. Yeah. And you haven't caught anything there. Are you going to get the guaranteed spirit tomb? I would have to do a lot of grinding in the underground uh, to get it. If assuming it works mechanically the same way, 
what do you have to do? In the last game, you have to talk to 64 people in the underground or something like that. Oh, so it's just as bullshit as the way to get it in uh, Sword and Shield. Okay, cool. I forget these. I, I, I'm pretty sure the number is 64, but I forget exactly. I did see a YouTube video uh, that was uh, telling you, uh, telling me how to get Spirit Tomb uh, early two badges. Uh, that was on the thumbnail. Probably can. It's probably yeah. Just get it here and immediately go to the underground. And do whatever. Just run around on the internet for an hour. It's also not as busted in this gen because fairies exist now. It's not immune to uh, uh, super effective damage anymore. I guess you'll just have to get another Bidoof. I, uh, hot take, I guess. You can never have it too many produce. Ooh, He's doofless. Free berries at the Berry Master's house. It's the Pokemon Research Corner. Today we'll examine a wild Pokemon live in the field. Ah, here we go. A wild Pikachu can eat in the came along. Oh, it's holding something. Let's roll up on and take a look. Hi there. Can I take a look? Yeah, it should scratch my finger. But okay, now that we know that wild Pikachu has the possibility of holding a light bulb. Thank you, Pikachu. Here's your light bulb. Light bulb back. Ah, yeah. Ow, ow, ow. It scratched me again. I got a Mego Berry. Good job. Ooh, I can just buy those. I'm missing some spear things. Oh, you have to buy them individually. Yeah, I was thinking that. What, what does it scratch it with? Does it have to use a Pokemon? Maybe? You and I, let us create a scene, a fantastic tableau of battle. Artist William. Mine. It's baby. Rusty, did you know it's mine time? What? Yeah. It's no longer mine time. Mine time is now a crime. Crime time. BABIES! I love the first movie in that, uh, that trilogy. This dude's got so many infants. <laughs> this artist can fit so many babies in this baby. say Hard Home City, I say only this. Super contest shows. I'm gonna enter my darling Pokemon in them. Pee pee. Hard Home City is a great place. Every year it gets voted the most desirable place to live in Sydney. Hey, what's in here? I traveled a long way to take part in these super contest shows. I've given my Pokemon lots of profits. I'm confident we'll win our share of super contest shows. Super contest shows are interesting, but the ruins of Salacion Town are as, are as well. As a cameraman, it makes me happy to see all the Pokemon involved in Super Contest shows. Nathan. Yeah? Are you ready for Poffins? Oh god. Hashtag Poffin time! Now, there's that's a, hashtag bunny time. There's a bunny there, I promise. Oh, thank goodness that you happen to be there. If it weren't for you, who knows how far away my Bunary could have run. Baby Veneri, back into the Pokeball you go. I'm Kiera. I'm a Super Contest Show Judge. Please drop by the contest hall so I can thank you properly. Thank you, Sammy. 
One, two, step. One, two, flip. And turn. Is that Chansey supposed to be doing a flip? Do a flip! Do a flip! You're a trainer, aren't you? You've got two choices of challenges, either a gym or super contest show, right? I like how it does the, the pan shot every time you talk to a sign for the first time. Hard home city, lot more than kind. The f is this kid right? Yeah. Well, I can't go over here yet. Hi, do you want a Pokemon egg? They're found at this Pokemon nursery in Salacian Town. Want to take it? Yes. Hold up, you don't have enough room for the egg. Hold I can up. Fix that. Uh. Yes, there is only one option, uh, and it is crap. Oh shit, wrong thing. I like eggs. This is what I heard about eggs. If you take that egg and travel with energetic Pokemon, it'll hatch. I remember someone uh, someone announced that. Professor Elmo Johto, maybe? How you doing, Rusty? I'm just so done with full restores. I'm visiting here all the way from the Hoenn region. I had been hoping to find the contest hall, but being new, I lost my way. Fortunately, the local people very kindly led me to destination. I was impressed by the kindness of the generosity of a complete stranger. Now I may off offer the courtesy of showing you the contest hall? No thanks. Paw fence, paw fence, paw fence. Oh, wait, no, this is the wrong house. Hello, I'm Jubilife TV. May I hit you up for a quick interview? Yes. Thank you so much. Let's not waste any time. Your Manaphy is quite appealing, isn't it? May I have your comment on your Manaphy? I see, I see. Thank you very much. We'll be featuring this interview on a later date. Please do tune in and show you, see how you look on TV. They don't let you put in your own stuff? Guess not. Yeah, my man, if it's rad as hell. Tight as fuck. Hello, hello. How I say do you do? I'm the Pokemon Fan Club Chairman. Indeed, yes I am. When you wish to treat your Pokemon as a treat, what I say do you do? If I may say so, I will. I feed Poffin. And I will. I feed Poffins to my Pokemon. And why, I say, would I do that? Because why, the giving I of say... I say, I say! <laughs> I got a Poffin case. He is kind of a jelly Welcome to Pokemon Fan Clan. Oh, you're Eric. It's very friendly towards you. I can t uh, tell you to treat it kindly. But if I swap to my eight... It may not be a nice friendship yet. I'm not gonna have a Rosalia for a long time. Let me go here and see what's in this book. There are super contest shows, then we have Amity Square. We have villagers from all over, so we need to keep the city looking nice. People all over the world follow super contest shows. What should I do? Should I captivate the whole world? Sammy, we're always into whatever horrifying thing you're working on. Sure. Yeah, show me. Show him the horror. I have something for your Pokemon to hold. Take the shell bell. Hell yeah. I know who that's going on. Up to you. I knew I was gonna get the shovel out there. When I take my baby out in the stroller, I see the town in a different way. I notice things like stairs and bumps in the sidewalk. Rusty, I need you to say this with your mouth. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
I feel the baby stroller getting heavier each and every day. I wonder what kind of Pokemon my child would become friends with first. For just a second, I was like... Papa Mama! I, I was like... I, th I thought I was going to say, um, I wonder what kind of Pokemon he'll become. <laughs> A couple of those. I'm gonna grab me some nest balls just for ducks and eggs. I want a couple of super potions. Supper potions. I think that's gonna be it. I'd like to buy uh, the item or buy it, but they won't give it to uh, sell. They won't sell it to someone who has only two gym badges. I've heard there are lots of stickers to be found. Someone told me you can find some in Amity Square. Thanks, I hate it. Hello, you may cook berries and turn them into poppins. I'd like to cook. Oh, berries do I want to? Let's try a raspberry, a blueberry, a nanab berry, a pinap berry. It feels like he's Naruto running at us. Nart. Don't spill. Don't spill! Burn it! Come on, push through! Push through! Go burn! Hurry! All done. Put away the sweet poppins in the poppin case. Sweet poppins level 8! Times 4. Hi, let's get cooking. Here's my advice on cooking tasty poppins for your Pokemon crew. In the beginning, while it's still a batter, swirl it gently to avoid spillage. When it starts to harden, turn it fast in big circles. At the end, make a wish for it to turn scrumptious and then whirl it! Eating good food makes people in Pokemon more energetic and happy. In that sense, we're exactly alike. Have you got some berries? To make delicious poppins, the key ingredient is a rare berry. Also, poppins will come out yummy if you cook berries as quickly as possible, but still slowly enough that you won't spill a batter. batter. I used a water stone to evolve my poke uh, on my Pokemon, and it evolved. Nathan, Ian, are you ready to go into foreign building? Let's see, you come in here and you save the game. Oh, it just says Heart Home City in Diamond and Pearl. If you save the game in here, it's listed as foreign building. When people in Pokemon join hands, everyone's happy. It makes everyone come together. It could even make the world one. There are still words that uh, that not everyone can describe. The words are love and joy. There's also no music in here. Oh, oh shit. That people are lonely is only natural. It gives me compassion for others. It's what makes me look forward to a better tomorrow. There are still moments of fondness for the past. Time can heal some sadness, though. Don't worry. If there were music playing, it wouldn't be good music. And there I do see my father, my son, my life. And there I do see nature, Pokemon, the world. Do I bow to him? Guess not. The art of crafting things fatigues one's spirit. 
When the spirit is healed, the desire to make something returns. Such is a wondrous cycle. Pokemon, people, it's only natural that we are so very different. Make sure that we never judge a Pokemon based on its weak or strong. We must always look for the good inside of them. That's what counts. That's what Nathan's like. It's like, yeah, I like all of the Pokemon. I do feel like I have a genuine love and affection for other Pokemon. But that's just me. And then there's Sunkern. I love Sunkern. Sunkern's great. No, Sunkern's not great. You can love Sunkern. That's not a problem at all. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. We, try, uh, we restore your Pokemon to full health. She didn't heal my egg. Have you seen the globe at the GWS in Jubilife City? No, they won't let me in there. It's so awesomely awesome. I can't really explain it well, but it's downright wicked. Hello, do you have a Poffin case? If you haven't got one, you really must visit the Pokemon Fan Club. They're saying Jim Lander Fantina's not around. Huh, she must have heard that I'm here. I'm around and chickened out. Hiya! Oh, I've seen you around somewhere before. Where was it again? Hold on, it'll come to me. Oh yeah, you're the one who was battling those scary looking guys in Jubilife City. I was really curious about you after that, so I went ahead and did a little research. That's a terrifying prospect. And then, surprise, surprise, turns out you're connected to famous Professor Rowan, and you've been going around defeating gym leaders too? I seriously thought my eyes were going to pop out of my head. Oh, sorry, there I go, there I go running around my mouth. It's me, BB. You remember me, don't you? I'm the one who gave you those ball capsules. And hey, you know those Pokemon boxes you've been using them? I'm the assistant administrator of them. My buddy Bill developed the basic storage system. I just tinkered it with you here and there to make it easier to use. Anyway, now that you're here in Home City, how about trying a Super Contest show? Be sure to use those stickers of yours, don't you dare forget. Sure. Where could Fantina be? There are just so many stickers to place on the ball capsules, I can't decide what I should use. I go see Pokemon all day long, but they sure are many kinds. How many are there now? Like 800 something? 852 is what's they're gonna have. No, that's not right. 898. Yeah. Uh, babies are in po and Pokemon get along perfectly together. If the babies take naps, then Pokemon go to sleep right next to them. Wow, you're a trainer. That makes you both a papa and a mama to your Pokemon. You know how uh, uh, having Pokemon around leads to new discoveries? It's the same for parents and kids. I'm always learning from my kids. Cool. 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 When I get bigger, I'm going to be a trainer, too. Oh, wow, you're a Pokemon trainer. Having lots of Pokemon around is a lot of responsibility, but it also comes a lot of fun. Yeah, because you're hiding in the corner, kid. Hardhome is a kid-friendly city, they say, but I disagree. Hardhome is friendly to kids, grown-ups, and Pokemon, too. All my grandchildren are clamoring for Pokemon of their own. It may be tricky to manage it, but it will brighten the mood more. A world in which people are compassionate to others. That's all that matters to me. Oh, no, there are no stairs in this house. It's easier this way. The lack of stairs makes it easy for little Pokemon to get around. Where are all my freebies? Give me stuff! I was given a TM for strength with the Lost Tower. The Lost Tower is on Route 209 on the way to Silesian Town. Hey, that's where you get strength. I've been in total seclusion in the mountains for 30 years. I'm going to clean up at some super contest shows with a dance move I came up with. Took me 30 years to come up with this dance move. After passing this gate, you'll find a paradise where lots of Pokemon play. Or so I've heard. Gotcha. Go oh, no. I thought I found a secret little path. 
I'm appalled. They refused entry to my Pokemon. Oh my Gyarados and Steelix. You can take cute Pokemon for a stroll in Amity Square. Let's see if I have any cute Pokemon. You can take a cute Pokemon out for a stroll in Amity Square. Which Pokemon would you like to take a stroll together with? Abraham is eligible. Give me an Eric is isn't cute. cute. Jinx. Please do enjoy your time with Abraham. Just the two of you. Just the two. I'm just following me around. Yeah. Look at that. Hi, monkey. Abraham is looking endearingly at you. You should talk to your Pokemon and occasionally find things. Clefairy. Something shiny in Clefairy's hands. Give me your shiny Pokemon. Give me your shiny, comma, Pokemon. In Amity Square, you can use the right stick to move the camera around and view your walking partner in Pokemon as much as you like. You can also reset the camera to its original rate by, uh, state by pressing and holding the right stick. Good monkey. Let's really zoom in. Push the monkey. Boom. So Driftblood is cute, but not Manaphy? Uh, Driftloon was cute in the uh, original games. I know. There are ruins from a long, long time ago. The Pokemon that that uh, abducts children. And a spooky place. The power to defeat giants infuses this place. single day. I let it run free without any worries at all. <laughs> Abraham almost stripped. He was ecstatic about it. Trainer tips. In Amity Square, you can press the plus button or the minus button to gather up all your Pokemon that are playing there. Just press the plus or minus button and it'll let your Pokemon return to what they were doing. So I can have, like, multiple Pokemon up at once? It seems to be the case. Hello there, you may cook berries and turn them into poppins. Uh, no thanks. I only remember being able to get into two of the buildings. These other ones there just for decoration, right? So 
I thought the Bailey's had like warp surge or something. It's possible. I don't know. Um, I'm, I, I'm genuinely not spoiling. I don't know. It's possible it unlocks more after the Elite Four. Oh, it looks like Pokemon that was taking a stroll wants to go out. Only special trainers can make their Pokemon feel that way. I'm pretty sure that Pokemon would be delighted if you let them out in Pokeballs outside this court, too. Oh, can I let my Pokemon follow me now? It's the star on it. Leave. Yeah, he's following me. Oh, is it only certain Pokemon? Oh no, it's walked together. Oh, Manaphy! Pokemon! Oh, so he's staying with me. These guys just fucking bolted. Get 
haven't gotten any items. Any items for me? Pick who yeah. follows us. Um, let's go with Greta. That's the correct choice. I have to be outside. I do too. Walk together. Oh, yeah. Good. Ground at the speed of ground. Oh, I get it. This is what I wanted. This is the future the liberals wanted. Baby mode. Oh, I'm so sorry. Please excuse moi. I'm entering. Are you entering a super contest show? Oh ho ho! Enjoy yourself, please. Incidentally, Fantina, the heart home gym leader, happens to be a super contest show expert. But you may ask yourself, how do I know this? Well, I am Fantina. You may challenge me, but not yet. You must become much stronger. Then you may challenge. Me. Yeah, this ain't platinum. This ain't platinum. Yo, mama's in a contest. Kira, oh, my hero. Oh, hi, Nate. What? No, really? Joanna is your mom? So you might be a super contest show star? Oh, I don't know about that. I never spoke to Nate about super contest shows. I'm surprised you two know each other, though. Oh, yes, that's right. I need to thank you earlier. Here, take this sticker. I got an ethereal sticker C. You got what? That's a nice touch of sophistication and glamour. I'm a show judge, so come join us for all kinds of fun. If you're unsure of yourself, we also offer practice sessions. Okay, Joanna, see you. Were you surprised to see me, Nate? I got bored, so I came to Heart Home for a little vacation. Is it, uh, I'm, I'm just as surprised to see you here, my dear. But you are serious about entering super contest shows. Not dressed that way. It's your Pokemon's time to shine, so you shouldn't be dressed your usual way. Put this Spoilers, on. She's gonna give you a pretty dress. Yep. Oh, damn it. I was wrong. Uh, let's go into our bag. And key items. And a coffin case. I'm gonna open it. Um, I'm gonna give. Uh, and let's do. That Poffin definitely hit Eric in the It foot disdainfully up. ate the Poffin. Yeah, Eric likes better food, Nathan. I can't believe you didn't know what type of food your Pokemon liked. Joy happily ate the Poffin. Because it likes sweet food. Abraham ate the poffin. He eats anything. That is very funky of him. Uh, and let's save that last one. Um, it's a frame to display a photo. Your Pokemon selected as the star of the show, it'll put up its photo. Today's the day. I'm finally going to compete in a contest show. Yeah, definitely. Are you going to enter a contest show too? A Pokemon fed Poffin does better in visual evaluations. I better learn how to click deli cook delicious Poffins at the Poffin House. Every super contest show has three parts. Visual, dance, and contest mode. Each contestant will be graded in those categories. Do-ho-ho. -ho. 
Quack, quack. My boyfriend gets so nervous that he can't work up the courage to enter a contest show. What should I do? Are you going to enter the super contest shows? Yep, you have a poffin case. Let me give you this wonderfully, uh, fabulously wonderful poffin. I received a mild poffin. It's so dumb that you basically have to beat three Garchomps. Sorry. Wow, Rusty. Spoilers. The mild poffin has a smoothness of 40. Who should I feed this mild poffin to? Or should I save it for Alexander? Retta. Alright. Welcome to the contest hall. I can help you out with regging for a super contest show. Can you enter a Pokemon? Would you like to enter a Pokemon in a super contest? Tell me more. Uh, super contest show basics. Yeah. Laura on the floor. Enter. Um, Rusty, I'll let you pick my contest. Uh, who are you entering it? Um, we'll decide after you do that. Let's do a coolness contest. And cool Joker. Uh, let's do a normal one. Select. So who is my coolest Pokemon? Uh, in an evolution, it'll be. Uh, I'm gonna use Greta because it has a bunch of cool. Oh, I get to pick their height points. My groove is positive. Um, let's do Smackdown. Gotta use his rock set. Good luck. Everyday style, contest style, or platinum style. Ooh. Which one do I pick? Um, I got platinum style, so I'm gonna pick that. Super contest show. Cool, this contest normal. Right? Oh, that guy has a cape. That dude's literally wearing a cape. From Kid Icarus? I think you got four. I can't compete with that. Remember it was a rhythm game. It wasn't. And some shining. Hit X. Get the shoes off because it's SmackDown! Pretty cool. Success! What a successful super contest show. You got some hall points. It's time to announce the stars of the show. Oh, yeah, it was definitely Nate. It was definitely Greta. Nate and Greta! Damn! Such a good dancer. 
did good dance. Congratulations on becoming stars of the show. Please accept this coolness sticker A as your reward. I want to see Greta. I want to see Greta. I want to see Greta. Star of the show! It's Greta! Look at Greta! My baby! She's a star of the show! She did great. She did Greta. She did incredible. Incredible! Ah. Uh, I think it was the guy you talked to at the counter. Oh, you gave me the super special awesome pop poppin? At a contest show, you gotta pull off cool contest moves. They'll rack up a lot of hearts from the audience. If you and the other contestants show your moves off back to back, you'll score bonus points. Cool! Crazy poker contest, Mom Nate. Yeah! Yeah, Nathan's the crazy contest mom. For move evaluation, you only get one shot. Coordinate with other performers and use your contest move when you feel the time is right. Have you placed a lot of stickers on your competing Pokemon's ball capsule? The more stickers there are on your ball capsule, the flashier an entrance your Pokemon will make. And just between you and me, different stickers seem to pair well to different contest shows. Hey Rusty, how's it going? It's, you know... I feel like it's not very you know. <laughs> Good job, Greta. You get to eat. Because eating is for closers. Jesus. <laughs> So, uh, today we learned that Nathan is a monster. Nathan is a monster. Uh, actually, Greta's a monster. A pocket monster. I guess it's okay to abuse your, your pocket friends because they are monsters. <laughs> I'm a monster. <laughs> 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 this is very good. <laughs> I'm Sisyphus. I'm rolling a boulder uphill. <laughs> <laughs> rolling, rolling, and rolling, rolling. <laughs> Easy that face and shoot me. Hey, it's Barry. I mean, it's like Ash <laughs> Ah. I, uh was not prepared for this battle. I'm game. well aware. I am down a mod. Really hope I don't need my Alakazam for this fight. Samuel keeps buffering, like... Does stream keep buffering? Because I've got it pulled up here and it seems to be going well. Is it voice or buffering for you? He plays the guitar. <laughs> nice. Switch my Pokemon. Uh, let's go. Joy. I haven't gotten any buffering. Um. So you might refresh stream. He's gonna show me something wicked too. Um, it's probably a 2 KO. Maybe 3. I'm gonna swap to 8 just for guessing. You're getting hit. I was gonna say paralyzed. Let's see. Uh, he's probably not gonna use stun spawn because I had an electric type on. Yeah. Oh. Um, then I don't know how to help you, Sammy. I. I haven't seen us buffer at all. And we're actually doing pretty good, like, on our end, all things considered. Aspen Chugan's gonna use Print Not on my watch. 
Who oh, your watch is on your wrist. Not on my Pokechi's not. Don't bubble my beam. You don't get your beam. I like my bubbles. Your bubbles. I got beam. You beamed my bubbles! But thankfully you shocked his wave. Uh, the reason that did so much damage to my Luxio is because he got the Hey, our friend Jaybird's on there. My friend Jaybird! He's a good bird. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Bro, you haven't won a fight against him. Poor ass Machuggin. Yeah. J4. What about J4? Is he here? No, he, he was just online. He flashed online. Ah. Like, his, his name popped up. He didn't flash online. God, could you imagine? No, I actually understood that. I'm not going to continue this line of thinking, never mind. This is from the subreddit Not The Onion. The article title is Woman Swallows AirPod Instead of Painkiller Records Audio from Stomach. Okay. So it's 8.50. I don't know how late you want to go tonight. Sorry. Uh, maybe, I don't know, let's say 15 minutes over. Okay. And maybe this is the whip side of me, but I'm not sure if I could do something that's over yeah. again. Your boy might be a little tired. Same thing, are you getting Nintendo news in Japanese? Bonsley Sturdy plus play. I didn't remember that Bonsley got sturdy. That's a very stacked tree. I've met stuff. I get it. Oh, there's that shell bell. It healed me. Well, the solution is simple, Sammy. Simply learn Japanese. <laughs> or, sorry. Simply learn Japanese, you sussy baka. Stop. You 
it's hair. <laughs> it's coming up. 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 It's hair. Oh. A good rod is really good. Wouldn't you agree? We're of identical minds. Take this good rod. Mm -hmm. I obtained a good rod. That's a good rod. And you can catch more than magic arps now. I mean, I'm just happy that I can catch more than magic arps. I mean, it's still m m more likely than not that you're catching a magic arp, but. Talk to me. You jog every morning too. Oh right, they battle you in the morning. It's weird that they made the Pokemon like not walk through a little. Yeah. Hmm, yes, I know you uh, you and the Pokemon Club chairman. I knew you and the Pokemon Club chairman would hit it off. I'm so happy that you've become one of us. Please take these as a token of our friendship. Flora stickers E. Nice. Chester berries, also nice. The boy likes waking up from sleep. They're gonna crunch and munch me up, yeah. have to understand the word unsubscribe in uh, Japanese. on this Pokemon and catch it. Hi, hi, I'm a Pokemon. See, it's a Pokemon. Just like, I'm just imagining like, you're sneaking up just like, <laughs> <laughs> choking it out. Get in the Pokeball! Get in the Pokeball! <laughs> Bringing the water type out against the third who clearly dresses a Pikachu the best call. Oh no. Oh no. Did you accidentally resubscribe a lot of times? <laughs> yup. jogging the other day, a wild Pokemon came after me. I ran so fast I was on top of the waves, I swear. There's a broken, crumbling tower made of stone. There seems to be a spot that would be a perfect fit for the odd keystone. Would you like to use the odd keystone? They push the odd keystone into the stone tower. The stone tower has been restored. Hallowed Tower is written on it. It's the Hallowed Tower. It appears to have been built many years ago. Now you gotta go talk to 69 people. Nice. That's right, Ian. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go get my catcher. Catch 
Are you? Which Pokemon do I want? Let's go with you. I don't think things are going very well for Rusty. No, I've I've stopped. That was just a yawn. Uh, Rusty, you said I was gonna catch a Beedoo. Nathan. <laughs> Nathan. You got me! I was wrong! Nathan, the Beaveril has seen some absolute shit, man. Those eyes have seen things, man. That Babara was like, I thought you were gonna catch a bit of too. I just changed. <laughs> what am I? I'm different and don't understand! My teeth are worse? Its movements out of water are sluggish. It can swim as fast as any Feebass. It's a weirdly specific Pokemon. Uh, Beeberil, I'm gonna name you. Uh, how about. Uh, let's go with. Uh, I'm never gonna use you, so I'm gonna give you a boring name. You did it. Good job. Great job, Homestreer. We're gonna be Beaver Bros. <laughs> you can't. Mm. Not good. <laughs> Super Beaver Brothers Ultimate. Tap tap. Can't keep up. Did you go and get the item that's down there? I'm working on it. Listen, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a Pokemon battle with your Pokemon. And your mind, Junior! Oh god, it's my time. Thought we got away from this. Yes. I usually wake up at Mime in the morning. At Mime in the morning? Yeah. I usually wake up at Mime in the morning. Sounds like a uh, Panic at the Disco song title. It does. She's just gonna throw every baby at Baby! Are you doing we will rock you like thump thump clap? No, I'm just kind of absentmindedly drumming with a chopstick. I wasn't even thinking about being on screen. Ah. I apologize.
Yeah, it really does not like to capture the aerial ace animation. No. No, video game capture is not a... They're raised with a lot of care. as held items, so I prefer to use my potions on them. I found a super potion from this lady. Okay, how am I talking to the golem there? <laughs> yeah, that's real bad. Let's go ahead and clip that. Mushroom. If you treat your Pokemon with care, they'll reward you with friendship and loyalty. Let me out, 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 let me out. Screeo. Oh, that's a statue. Did you find it underground? I just wanted to see one of these. I'll give you this as my way of saying thanks. Got some star stickers. How the fuck is he seeing the statue? How the fuck is he seeing the statue? Um, I'm gonna use the star statues. Star stickers. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna use it on my Luxio. Uh, cause... It's got the little star tail. Just right there in the middle. Yes. I like it. I like it a lot. And then I'm gonna use some... on my star avia. Yes! Yes, that's very cool. That's very good. I like how they kind of shoot out in different directions. Okay, Greta. Just gotta push my rock. You got no awakening. I wonder what's up at the lost top of the lost tower. I'm very curious, but I'm also very scared. Tweet. Weedle D. You find a bottle of calcium. I'd like that you can see that in the little. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna let you pick our next Pokemon. Uh, you should pick Ryan. It was overflowing with that energy, immediately stretched out and relaxed. Gasoline! Smackdown! You killed that ghost? If a ghost dies, does it become a super ghost? Or... Like, come back to life or something? Don't worry about it. Ghost! Maybe that's how hauntings happen. Most ghosts just, like, move on. But if they get double killed... That's my haunt.
Hi there, where are you from? What kind of Pokemon have you got? Cowgirl Shelly. Oh shit. I like how she kind of floated there. Yeah. The cowgirl. Can they just do that? <laughs> do you get the ability to fly when you become a cowgirl? I hope so. Flying cowgirl sounds like something you shouldn't look up on Urban Dictionary. <laughs> Nixon, you can't say that. Um, Adam, on this one, you're gonna have to look between the lines. She's a cowgirl and she's really into beavers. Oh. I'm really into it. Gay people exist, Carl. <laughs> Excuse me, they're lesbians, Carl. <laughs> Winona did have a big brown lesbian. What? Jamie, <laughs> I have no idea what you're referring to, and I'm not sure I want specifics. <laughs> <laughs> fancy folks like you have fancy Pokemon too, it looks like. <laughs> I'm a simple kind of cowgirl. I only really like one thing. Did you just say that? Scared your god. So back when it was like a four, uh, like a Gen Four sprite, I kind of assumed that the things, like the markings above its eyes, were like eyelashes with like weird orbs at the end of them. What? So let's look at like the twin tails. No. Look at Eric. He's got the little yellow like yeah. orbs yeah. above his eyes. I thought those were like eyelashes that just like had orbs at the end for some reason. Uh, but they're clearly, like, patterns on its face. Yeah, they're, like, markings. Again, because it's the god of the sea. Or one of them. Uh, I think his name is actually the Prince of the Sea. Steel Ving. Yeah, I think uh, Lugia is still technically, like... It's the Guardian of the Sea. Yeah. Sammy, if I press play on this and it gets to stream... Is that gonna be a problem? I like how the young couple is just like, especially like the guy is just like, he's just a guy. Uh, I don't want to be a rat inside. Or a rock type. What, with two, uh, two fighting types out? But maybe getting the Intimidate off on here is That's kind of my, my thought process. Probably a good idea. Definitely a good idea this one. Did they both go there? Uh, I killed the, uh, Machop. Uh, but it used low kick, and low kick is not a move that Golem likes. Yeah, that does. He's a thick boy. That does a lot. I'm sorry, Ty. 
I only have eyes for Sue. Maybe that's why we lost. We lost. Ty, I need a hug to make it better. Sue, even in defeat, you're beautiful. Uh, we'll do the Lost Tower next time. Uh, we're going to stop right now as soon as I get to the, the Pokemon Center. Uh, like I said, I may do a little bit of grinding off stream. Uh, or not grinding, uh, like exploring of the underground off stream. Um, but I don't know, I might not. Because we're going to be back streaming tomorrow, so we'll see if I even get a chance. Um, but uh, if you guys will join us tomorrow, we'll continue along with this. And um, anything else? The, um, we probably are going to be off starting Thursday through yeah, the Thurs weekend. Yeah, Thursday through uh, the weekend. Because Thanksgiving. Um, so... Uh, uh, in the time of Thanksgiving, uh, remember uh, fuck Christopher, uh, Christopher Columbus. That's a dick. Yeah. And uh, and uh, the Republicans need to stop jerking off to him. Bye!